Alright, welcome back to Oria. Did a live stream of this a while ago, but I never finished it. So we are continuing our search for something. Hello. Oh, I'm so happy I can show you. His tones, jet black, black and dark blue. Shades faced by a castaway in the depths of the sea. Yes, sir. Oh. Alright, set sail. Bring me something good. Can we make any hats? Ooh, we can make plenty of hats. Well, I guess we already made these. So we just need more materials for these. Okay. Alright, so I don't know where we're going. It's been a second before since I played this. If we go up here, we jump up there and go to our right here. Oh, I already found that, okay. Ow. Alright, where are we going? We are going here. To Fallen Town. The town of Fallen. I don't know if I'm gonna finish this game in one video. Because it might be like an hour long video. I don't know. Because the live stream was about an hour ish. And also, using Streamlabs, I couldn't turn up my mic, so this game just like drowned out my audio. Which. It's unfortunate. This place has lost everything, even its name. Looks like we're not going further. Alright. But yeah, that was about an hour-ish long, and we basically got... I think halfway through the game, or at least a quarter of the way through the game. Because this game is relatively short. Short but sweet. I much rather a game be sort of short rather than try and draw itself out. Are you the one with the harpoon? Maybe. Alright, well. Let's just continue along. So we can go through that door, or we can go up here. Break all this stuff. See, there's a music box up there. We can't get to it. However, if we go over here, there's a crew member here. There's also a timer here. smooth at least in my book all right so we can go to the right here just to explore a little bit not much to explore so let's go ahead and go inside the deep dark cave And here we are. Oops, I am sorry for that. Get ourselves an apple. Who doesn't like apples? Thought I could go up there. Ow. Alrighty then. How about you not? Alright, cool. So yeah, there are 40 ships in a bottle, and 
I personally haven't been able to find all of them, but I know that there's a speedrunning guide, which gives all the locations of them, and I did not do this correctly. Ow. I need to go to the other location first. Whoops. Yeah, I need to, I need to go to the other location first. Okay, well. This is slightly embarrassing. All right, come on. Well, I can't leave. Hold on. Oh, I know what I'm supposed to do. Okay, I'm thinking too far ahead. All right, all right. Ow. Ow. There we go. We gotta do. No, that's not right. Hold on. Let's just leave you there. And then... We can go down here. And there we go. So that opens... Ow. I shouldn't have done that. Okay, hold on. Curious. Because that opened this up. But, oh my goodness, I just get, got rid of my charge. Hold on. Okay. Things are going great. Okay, leave that there. Get that back. There we go. This opens this up, which is a ship in the bottle. How nice. And then we can go here and, yeah. Go up here. Fight some bad guys. These weird mouth things. And grab ourselves a ship in the bottle. Shipping a bottle. And I can go through here, accidentally kill a guy, and... Yeah. Alright, where are we going? Okay. Ow. I did not think that was going to explode. Oh, you live and you learn. Oh boy. Okay. Oh wow. I didn't know you could do that. I just killed that guy with that skeleton. And that automatically... Okay, I... I accidentally... Killed that one creature with the skeleton. And then... He couldn't do anything because... I guess he was possessing that one guy that I killed. That was the most confusing explanation I've ever done, but hey. What can you do? Like, see, I hit... Okay, that's interesting. So I killed that guy with this thing. And he automatically went into his little panic phase. All right, that's pretty cool. Yeah, we needed to kill that guy to do the lever. Lever, lever, however it's pronounced. We can go down here, get exploded again. Cause that's always fun. 
Yeah, you got that right. Wait, why did we activate this again? Oh yeah, I guess it was to go over here. Hello? Hey guys, how's it going? Excuse me. I need through here. Hello, or a lot of you. Ow. Oh my goodness, don't die. I said don't die. And look what you did. Look at what you did. Alright, someone got shocked. Okay, well. Alright, so what we have to do... Is we gotta... Grab... Ow. I guess I could go down here first. It's basically just the same way, just a little bit of a different path. Actually, it's a dead end. Never mind. Don't listen to me. Alright, we need to electrocute this. Avoid the water here. And then we go down here. And we don't go down here. We go up here. throw that down and that will we can bring this back and that probably wasn't right all right hold on it's a learning process ow ow how many things am I gonna smack into all right we grab this Throw that. There we go. Let me just walk on over and head inside. Those ships. How does anyone survive here? Continue forth. You scared me a bit. It's playing for the lost ones. Sometimes I think they like my music. Will they ever be saved? I don't know, man. Man, you don't have to depress up the room. Now everything's all depressing. There. How about that? Now they're saved. Need 
here we can grab the key. Which makes everyone freak out and try to attack us. Off, off, get off. Get off of me. If you're not. Dude, don't. Get off. Phone, that was not the time. Oh my goodness, this is a mess. Okay. I might not even upload this. Do I really want to upload a video where I don't know where I'm going and where my microphone just fell over? Alright, we finally escaped. After all that chaos. I don't know why my wi my microphone just decided to fall over. I want to try and get a hanging microphone to try and prevent that and to also prevent my keyboard thumping from being picked up. I don't know if their souls can ever be saved. But they must be forgiven. They have witnessed unimaginable terrors. I suppose. I thought my hands would never hold that sword again. know what can happen. Hello little bird. Goodbye bird. Alright, hello people. How's it going? You doing good? That's good. What'd you bring me back? Oh, Johnson, I love you. I love you. Alright. So, what we have left is we need to... We need to visit the Royal Domain. Alright, we're gonna have another... Experience with Oria. Fresh air and clean water. This is the royal family's domain. That somehow remains unstained. My rhymes I cannot contain. If we go up here, we grab ourselves a ship in a bottle and see these two. Don't tell anyone. Fine. Fine, I won't. I won't tell anyone. Alright, anyway. Don't worry, I'm not gonna tell anyone. I mean, like... I don't know, I kissed a few people here too. It was, you know... Was, uh, shut up. Alright, so we gotta avoid the, that guard down there. 
Otherwise, he's gonna give us a bad time. So we gotta use stealth. We gotta be stealthy. see here how do we do a puzzle there we go if we do that we can go over here and get ourselves another ship in the bottle I don't know why I keep saying the bottle there's not like one definitive bottle for each of these tiny little ships. Alright, and then we have to do that, and then throw that there to open this door. Hello. Okay. be stealthy here. Alright, cool. I don't know if he's gonna see me jump out. A flower. We go up here. Grab her a flower. saxophone. Alright, now we just gotta wait for her. Technically, you're supposed to walk with her, but kind of in a hurry. We just gotta wait. And she's going to give us the second key. Of course we get kicked out. Are you two still kissing? Ow. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. Alright, sorry. Come over here, please. Please. Ow. Alright, fine. Alright, so now that we have the two keys, we can head to the old archives where we're gonna get another map piece. Which is going to reveal this area over here. But I will be doing that next time. So.
Yeah, so we have that one last dungeon to do in that section, and then we get a new map piece, and I think there's like two or three more things to do before we face the final boss. So yeah, I like this game. It's uh, it's pretty neat. I also like, you know, how fluid the movement is and everything. Some people complain a little bit that the graphics are too pixely, which I guess I can understand. I don't know. Some people wanted like that anime looking opening at the cinematic trailer. But I don't know. I mean, usually trailers aren't that accurate to the actual game anyway. But I don't know. I like the graphics. Anyway, next time we will do that final dungeon and reveal the next area. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Take care.